have those people that you see they're in your life or they're on TV or whatever it is that you're watching and you're like, man, they have the life that I want. I want to live life like them. Well, let me tell you, you can do it. And it's through the law of attraction. Hi there, I'm Wendy. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today, we're gonna to talk about a couple tips to help you manifest your best life. So let's just jump right to it. You ever just see those people whose lives just look amazing and you're like, I want that. That's what my life needs to be. Well, let me tell you, you can have it too. And it's through the law of attraction. One of the main components of law of attraction is being able to visualize the life that you want or that goal you're trying to reach. Now, I know this can sometimes be a little convoluted and you're saying, Wendy, listen, I can see it, but I've been trying and trying and trying to get there and it just doesn't seem to happen. It just doesn't work for me. But let me tell you something. Here's the key. You have to have the feeling to go along with it. So when you are visualizing that dream car, that dream vacation, that dream life, you need to stop and think about how you feel inside once you achieve that state. Is that a sense of freedom? Is that happiness? What is that for you? So when you are visualizing that dream life, what do you feel like inside? And I want you to sit with that and resonate with that. So before you begin your visualization, let's back it up a step and let's get specific, crystal clear on what you're actually trying to create in your life. So I want you to get out a piece of paper, a pen, and really write down what your clear intention is. What it is that you want to manifest. What is it in your heart of hearts that you are trying to create in your life right now? Be specific. Write it down. If you have to scratch it off, it's okay. It's your list. Step number two, you need to set and create a clear image of what it is that you're trying to create. What does it look like when you're in this new state, your new reality, your dream? Visualization is the tool to help you create that imagery in your mind. You need to use it to think of that desired outcome, that objective, that goal, whatever it is you're trying to create, you create that in your mind and you start seeing yourself living that dream that you wanna create. Engage all of your senses. What does it taste like? What, it, what do you hear? What does it feel like? That is where you're going to make the magic happen, is really bringing in all of your senses into that mental picture that you've created for yourself. The reason that you're gonna visualize and really use that emotion is you wanna be able to tap into that subconscious feeling. Your subconscious mind, doesn't know what's real from what's not. So you want to use the power of your subconscious mind to make your dreams a reality. When you visualize your dreams, again, you're tapping into that subconscious. Your subconscious is already acting as if, as if it's already in your reality. I want you to take a minute here, close your eyes and really think about what you're trying to create. Let's do this together. Let's just take a few minutes. Do you see yourself in your desired reality? And while you're in this moment, I want you to think about how it feels. What are you feeling right now? Whatever those emotions are, I want you to write them down. Write down how you felt in that moment, in your dream reality. That is where the passion comes. That is how you manifest your ultimate dream reality is by invoking those emotions into that picture that you have of your desired state. Now, the last step here, it's practice. You keep practicing this over and over. Consistency is the key. Fit it in. It doesn't have to be consistently 10 minutes. You can do a couple of minutes in the morning, a couple of minutes at night. Make it work for your schedule, but you should do it throughout your day. If you have a moment where you're just sort of, if you're like me and you have a moment at work and you're just kind of spacing out, use that time. Use that time as a time for you to create your desired life. By incorporating all of this into your daily routine, this is how you tap into the power of the subconscious and truly turn your dreams into reality. Let me know down in the comments, 
what type of manifestation techniques that you either like or you wanna know more about. If you're interested in learning more about manifestation techniques, subscribe down below.